yo welcome so this is the first part sa series na uh, designing I'm gonna be designing a four story school building it's a 20 classroom building uh the design natin siya structural using stud pro a version the ss6 okay so first pakita ko sa inyo yung model the sketch up okay ito siya okay so hindi pa yun finish yung model natin it's a four story classroom building or school building and then 20 classroom so five rooms every floor and and then each side so every floor each end to new separate uh crs comfort rooms for boys and girls and then dun din nakalagay yung separate stairs or ba base bali dalawang stairs ha? okay a new model natin. And then we have a balcony uh we have a corridor that's it this is a four-story school building 20 classroom all right so start tayo sa purlin purlin design open tayo ng staad okay new project purlin lagay ko dyan SI units finish okay again I'm gonna get starts uh, zero zero origin okay, yung translate na lang natin yung node na yan okay check natin yung so bali edi design natin is yung total length ng purlin so from here up to here so end to end so pakita ko sa inyo yung plan architectural plan okay ito siya so end to end is mga 55 meters yan okay so typical classroom naman is 9 by 7 9 by 7, 9 meter by 7 meter. Yung typical na classroom. Magtitignan natin dito. Let's say start yung node natin dito. Then second node would be 5 meter from the first. And so bale, every grid, number grid, dyan yung trusses natin. So yan yung support natin sa ating Berlin. Yan. So every grid, meron truss tayo. Okay, so... Yan yung support na ating purlin. Ayan. So, 5. And then, bale, itatranslate. Ikakopy natin yung model natin ng 12. 12 copies. Okay. And then, first, 5 meter, uh, 5 me second node is 5 meter. And then, succeeding is 4.5. And then, the last is also 5 meters. Right? So, balik tayo sa staad. Select natin yan. Select node. Node cursor. Okay. Select natin yan. Go to. Translational. Repeat. So, again, imo-move natin yan on the positive x direction. Kasi dito tayo nag-start sa origin. So, dun tayo sa positive x. This one. Okay. Positive x. Ilang copies yun? 12. Okay, first one, next, uh, so node is 4.5. Okay, copy mo lang yan, then dito sa end is 5. Okay, and then, link steps, para automatic na siyang mag-add ng beam 
So, link mo na lang. Okay, link steps. Click OK. Bam. So, ilangin natin or control N para makita yung nodes. Ayan. So, 13 nodes or 13 supports tayo dyan. Okay. So, 13 traces, kumbaga. Okay, and then check natin yung distance. First part and end is R5 meters. And then yung gitna is 4.5. Okay. Done. Okay. Then erase natin yung measure. Para clean. Kung, uh, shift B. Yeah, nakikita yung beam number. So, nakikita dyan. Okay, tingnan natin. So yun, okay na tayo sa model.